Hello, everybody, and welcome back to another episode of Stardew Crossing, which is basically me just doing my Animal Crossing village in the map of Stardew Valley. If you want to check out last episode, you can go ahead and click on it over here. Then after yesterday's episode, we went on twitch.tv slash Philly Beats You. Uh, that is twitch.tv slash Philly Beats You. You should definitely come there and check me out. I'm probably streaming right now as you're watching this video. And we made a Starbucks cafe. Even Rory's into it. He wants to go to the cafe. Okay, never mind. He doesn't want to go to the cafe. We placed these elevated custom tiles. Which look really nice. We put in black iron tables. You know, with the iron green chairs. So we had that black and green Starbucks theme. We threw in some couches here. Those nice, nice brown couches. We have three of them over here. So you can come down, sit down, have a coffee. You know, relax with some buddies. We threw a Starbucks magazine on the table because why not read Starbucks while you're at Starbucks enjoying Starbucks while drinking your Starbucks, right? The menu we got over here with all the, you know, the menu stuff. Then we have our, 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 our sugar and milk and we have our coffee machine right here. Look at this. It makes coffee. Oh my gosh. Then if you want something to go along with your coffee, you get a, you can grab a snack from the machine. At nighttime, this thing is pretty lit up, so these lights look really good. We got the special mom mug on the table over here. We got a little plant for Axe in here. We got a little coffee as well over here. We stuck a little book, book, books and uh, a little rose for the accent, along with the sign on the outside with the little menu here as well. You know, we got some desserts because Starbucks has desserts. We threw a wear open sign so you know it's open. And then we got a little Starbucks vending machine here. So you grab some drinks or whatnot. And I think that kind of completes this little cafe theme. I like it. I think it's comfy. We put it right next to yesterday's project, the fruit farm. So it looks kind of good. Now, today's project. Let's, let's talk about today's project. Since this is Stardew Valley kind of theme, aka the Stardew Crossing, we need to start getting some farms. So for today's project of making a coffee bean farm, we're going to need a few things. We're going to need this coffee bean tree over here, a.k.a. known as the cacao tree. And we're going to pretend it's coffee beans, even though those are really big coffee beans. We're then going to be using the scarecrow. Scarecrows are going to be used to, to make those crows go away. We're going to have our simple wooden fencing because that's how we're going to enclose the area. And we're going to have our, our, our camp sign used by this image of a Stardew Valley coffee bean, which... I will show the code right here. Another thing I added into the back of this is a silo. This is a DIY recipe. You go ahead. You obtain this with Nook Miles. And then you can go ahead and craft it. I customized mine to look a little darker. With the little green top. But yeah, this is the plan for today. I'm going to also show the custom patterns that we're going to be using here. So I'm going to throw those on the screen as well. Okay, now that you guys are all caught up with what we're doing, let's begin our project together. Let's go ahead and, and do our fencing here. This is looking good. Yeah, the fencing looks nice. Okay, so we have now enclosed this area. There we go, like something like that. Ooh, that's good. All right, next up, we have to make our pathway. So if you downloaded the codes from before... It's now time to enter construction mode. Yeah, we'll make them long. Yeah, we'll do long coffee paths. All right, so uh, let's let's begin. So maybe we get rid of two two spots there like that, right? Kind of make it like, oh yeah, this is dope. I could walk in here. That doesn't look bad at all. Maybe we'll add one more here. Okay, so the dirt is kind of placed down. And now it's all about us adding our a coffee, our cacao trees. All right, so let me get out of construction mode. Actually, you know what? We'll, we'll stay in construction mode. I don't know what we're doing here.
Let's place that there. Ooh, that looks good. Most of the coffee trees are now placed down. Now we just got to edit the ground a little to put like seed spots where it's semi growing because not everything has grown, right? So we're going to use this one over here. Replace like corners like that. Boom. To make it seem like, oh, we are growing some. You know, just got to give it that appeal. That looks clean. Hold on. Give me a second. Let's see if we get out the silo. There we go. We can add the silo. Very nice. And we'll use the same thing we used at the top. Oh, that's good. A nice wooden little pathway like we're going into our spot. Ooh, that's nice. I dig it. I actually like that. Ooh. This item over here is a Zen cushion. I've thrown a design onto it to make it seem like a seed bag. So it looks like we were using seeds. So yeah, it's, it's pretty cool. It's like, oh, these are the coffee seeds they're using. And I guess we can use floor lights on the outside of this coffee farm to light it up. Floor light number two. Floor light number three. Place it right there. Nice. So the cop, yeah, that's what I really wanted right there. And then I guess I could just throw one back here for the for the sake of it. Okay, uh, customize two coffee cups. We got one mug here. Place that right there. Ooh, baby. That's a Junimo cup. And we got the coffee cup for the coffee place. I think this coffee farm is looking fantastic. We got the dirt. We've got the plants. We've got the sign. We've got the lights at night to light up this area. We got the silo in the corner. It looks great. I hope this coffee farm tutorial was good for everybody. I tried my best. This is the best we can do. We have an animal singing in the corner. If you guys have any suggestions on how we can make this even better, let me know down in the comments below. I feel like we need a coffee grinder. Yeah, that's what we need here. Anyway, we'll be creating another area of this farm on Twitch. So you don't want to miss out. Head over to twitch.tv slash phillybeatsyou. I'll be building the next part of the farm there. And then uh, yeah, I will see you guys in tomorrow's video of Stardew Crossing. Have a great day, guys.